today's date? Today is the 23rd. March 23rd, 2016. Did five on each. Be damned if I got seven more to go. All right, folks, second set. We're going up to 45 pounds dumbbells. All right, on this set, I want you to remember what I'm focusing on is doing the same amount of reps. So I'm doing a different, a little different training method than the, uh, the traditional method of heavy weight, light reps, or vice versa, light weight, heavy, uh, high reps. I'm combining heavy weight, heavier weight, and either the same repetitions or higher reps to build muscular endurance and uh, more muscle tone for me. Something I've been doing for a while, something I've, I've liked the results of, but to each his own. Also, starting with this uh, 30 day, uh, second 30 day meal plan, I'm introducing more protein, so I do not, I'm gonna stay consistent without it having to use supplements other than in my EHT uh, for enhancement in my workouts or anything. I'm just gonna eat more lean protein uh, that is processable in my body. Honestly, I'm starting to pull away from the idea of uh, supplements uh, to a certain degree. Uh, so that's what I'm doing. So let's see what happens over these next 30 days to see what kind of body change we have. And also with these workouts for the next 30 days, it's isolated. So as you see, I'm using dumbbells, I'm focusing on all my exercises, legs or upper body, doing isolating both sides of my body at one time instead of utilizing uh, simultaneous, doing simultaneous reps. All right, with all that jargon and waste of time, here we go. Do your foot self a favor when doing this exercise, do not push these weights over your head. It's putting more strain on the shoulder blade and it's taking it out of the range of motion that is actually activating the pec muscles. Do not want to go out of the range of motion that is actually focusing in on the right muscle. Mm. That's wonderful. Again, we're focusing on that, allowing the weights to rest. All right, folks, I gave myself a little bit of assistance from this back rest because I didn't want to start swaying and utilizing other aspects of my body, i.e. Uh, shoulder. I wanted to focus everything on the bicep, which I did feel in the bicep. Uh, but using this back rest is actually keeping the core out of it and keeping you from that swaying motion. I'm definitely gonna need it on this set with the shoulders. Your belief can struggle at times, mine does. I gotta be honest with you. There's a lot of things going on in my life right now. It was very hard, like I said earlier in this 
in this segment. Uh, I was DWI. I didn't want it. But the fact that I'm able to help somebody else help me get over my issue or whatever was, was bothering me from uh, earlier on in the day or whatever. Um, so don't let that be an excuse. If you got air to breathe, you got ability in your body, no matter what's going on, fight through that urge to be lazy. Fight through that urge to just not want to fight through the urge of whatever tragic event or whatever happened at work or whatever happened at home. You gotta keep you in line. You have to keep you in line. That's the only way you become. So that being said, I'm gonna stop wasting this young lady's time and your time. I appreciate you for watching. Take a shot at this workout. I think you might like it, but have a spotter with you or a professional with you when you're doing this stuff or start at a weight resistance that you can handle. That's challenging, but it's not overwhelming, okay? Also, please, if you have issues prior to starting a workout program, consult your physician, get their advice on how you should progress through it and then begin your workout program. Core strength. Most important thing you need to understand about these exercises or any exercise program, we were born to walk upright. Therefore, in order for us to walk upright, we have to have tight core. I pretty much, my coping mechanism is put that crap down you've been eating. And I've learned honestly since I've come off that deal, when I was getting almost to the 30 day, my, my mood, my everything was just, my spirit was just in line and nothing really could face the feeling I was feeling. You know, I was grateful to be feeling those extra energy boosts, the no, no issues with my joints. Stuff that would come my way, whether it's got anything to do with me or not, I was able to handle it with a clear mind. When I got off of that, and this is why I say a lot of this shit they're putting in our food is poison. Started becoming irritable and, and you know mood swings. And I, you know nothing major, but just didn't feel like being bothered with individuals leading up to today. Nothing to say. Nothing bad to say about my camera lady, but. I didn't want to be around me today. I don't know how many people will admit that, but I didn't want to be around me today because I knew the good that's going to come out of this is going to have to contend with the bad that I've been feeling. Be calm. Bye.